It's the final game of the 2020 Frisco College Baseball Classic. Chris Mikoski and LaDaron McLean with you at the home of the Texas Rangers AA affiliate. Frisco Rough Riders, neither of these teams have had the kind of weekend they would like, but one of them will go home with a victory to close things out and hopefully carry some momentum into their midweeks. He won't actually head up to the plate. They'll replace him with somebody more appropriate when they know the situation. But OSU has done that. We've seen it before. Houston Morrill on an 0-1 pitch. He's heading for second. Slides in safely. Lead-off double for OSU. Caden Polkovich now for Oklahoma State, the junior out of Edmond. Pops up between second baseman Braun and Alejo in center. Falls right between them. Oklahoma State on the board. Polkovich nailed it second, but he gets the RBI. one nothing Cowboys. Mikey Honer with the bases juiced. Into right field. Cabanis on his horse. Can't make the catch. Frizzell will score. Everybody else will be held up. Aggies tie it. It's one to one. Two one in the dirt, and here comes Deloach. Two to one, Texas A&M. One one pitch, grounded to the left side of the infield. He plays at second, over to first. They can't turn two, and the ball gets away. Two Aggies score on this sequence. Four to one. Texas A&M. Well, that is the last time they won a national championship was 1959. Yeah, and the, the uniforms you like so much, they, they oh, paid yeah. homage to that team Friday. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's Over great... the head of Deloach, Trinkle will score. Polkovich will be held at third. RBI double for McCusker. And it's 4-2 to two, Texas A&M as Oklahoma State trims the deficit. So I know that's kind of a... If you just look at sheer record and how these two teams have played coming into the weekend. Line shot, oh, diving stab by oh. Blom. Can't quite double <laughs> off the Cusker, though. Oh, oh wow. Blom selling out. Makes a great diving catch. Unable to bring it in. Mathis, first pitch swinging, and he'll bring home at least one Cowboy as Polkovich scores, and McCusker will reach home plate as well. We're all tied up, 4-4, four to four, Texas A&M and Oklahoma State. Leading into this possible appearance by Majors. Going a little blind. Right back to him. He can't handle it, oh, though. No. And Oklahoma State uh. takes a 5-4 to four lead. Majors doing a fantastic job getting Mathis to strike out, and then Cabanis induces a ground out right back to him, but you can't get it done as a field. Wow. Well, well there I say the sun may have had effect to it. The only other SEC game on the schedule, Arkansas will play Baylor in the nightcap in Houston. 1-1 one, one pitch, right back up the middle. Bose delivers a pinch hit, RBI, and we are tied, 5-5. Five, five. Oh, one pitch coming to Carson McCusker. He rips this one in the left center. McCusker got a hold of this one to the wall. OSU will take a 6-5 lead in the ninth inning off the bat of Carson McCusker. Well, there's your validation. All tournament team, you got my vote already. I imagine there are some other people erasing a name and adding Carson's right now. <laughs> a little late voting here a couple of days before Super Tuesday in Texas. Yeah, this is the thing. You want that ball just to sink a little bit lower, but it hangs right where he likes it in the sweet spot. He waited on it right in the gap in left center field. Left. Nice Polkovich in. That's big time there. I had mine spread between a couple of different sports. Into right field, Garcia 
delivers a single, and here comes Carson McCusker, 7-5, Oklahoma State. Leaper looking to end it. 0-2 pitch to Blom into right field. Cabanis gets chase, and he makes the catch. The Oklahoma State Cowboys knock off Texas A&M 8-5 to close out the Frisco Classic.